Mm, good morning, everyone. For the love of tech, Aaron here. You're here because you like YouTube videos. I'm here because I like making YouTube videos. It is like a match made in YouTube heaven. If you're into that kind of thing, go ahead and hit the thumbs up button and don't forget to hit the subscribe button and share my content with your friends and family on social media. Today, we're going to talk about this autofocus issue with the Samsung Galaxy S20, specifically Ultra. That's right, the $1,400, commonly referred to as the $1,500 phone. It's like crazy expensive, amazing features, looks good, has this protruding aggressive camera hump. But for that kind of money, you should not be serving me up any sort of autofocus camera issues anywhere. It's unacceptable and I want you guys to see for yourself. So whatever you do, right? Don't go out and buy the phone, but don't go out and return it either because it's okay. You gotta give Samsung an opportunity to fix the phone. Now, when the iPhone comes out almost always, this is iPhone with the teardown skin on it, the 11 Pro Max, right? You can see my, my expensive cameras right there, 11 Pro Max. When that phone came out, there's always issues, there's always glitches, and they always push out a quick update. I only hope people will give Samsung the same courtesy that they give iPhone. Never quite seen a slew of people returning an iPhone, but I feel like there's this standard that's held higher at the moment because of the price. That's what you need to know. If this was a $1,200 phone or even an $1,100 phone, we might not be acting so crazy, but it's not. This is the $1,500 phone. It's insanely expensive. The screen is nothing like anything I've ever seen before. See, look, it's, it's, it's gorgeous. So let me go ahead and get into it and show you the issue with the autofocus. I'm going to take some B-roll on the iPhone. We're going to take some shots on the Pixel, the S20 Ultra, and the Note 10 Plus, which is phenomenal. I am holding off on doing my final camera review comparison from the S20 Ultra to the Note 10 Plus because I feel Samsung needs a chance to get it right. And I'm obsessively checking for updates. <laughs> for my phone, but I haven't gotten an update yet. There is an article out there that says that over in Korea, they're getting them first, and then we're supposed to get them sooner. And the rumor is it's supposed to be today. If today is the day, we'll find out. If today is the day, this video is going to be obsolete, probably even before it hits your inbox. But I'm gonna make it anyways, because I want you guys to know, the autofocus is crap. Don't return your phone, and it's okay. Don't buy it but give them a chance to fix it. If you already own it, give them, you, you get like 14 days to return a phone. Chill within your 14 days. See if Samsung will fix it. And I guarantee you, they're gonna fix it before that return period is up because they want everyone to keep it. So there you go. We have some typical YouTube props for the studio and we're gonna go ahead and uh, see how this autofocus works. So we are going to start with the Android dude. We're gonna put him right here. We're gonna come over to our Note 10 Plus. All right, so here we can see the autofocus. See how quickly he refocuses back on the little Android dude? That's what we mean by autofocus. It's like, boom. See how quick that was? Note 10 Plus autofocus. Move into the Pixel 4 XL. See how quickly that is? It's like, boom. It's actually crazy fast, the autofocus. It's like you can't even tell, right? You can't even tell that it's doing anything. That's how quick it is. That's how good it is. See how slow that was? You can visually see it's taking its time to autofocus. Whereas the other ones were like super quick. See that? And I know you're like, Aaron, it's a couple seconds. Stop your bitching. But I'm like, it shouldn't be like that because the Note 10, the generation before last year's technology is 10 times better. So why can't I have 20 times better? 
I'm paying like $400 more for this device. Look how slow that, look how slow it is. And we're really gonna confuse it. We're gonna put two subjects in the picture. See that? What? What's happening here? See, I've confused it. Okay, there we go. But you can see like how slow it is. What is that? What is that? I'm gonna take a picture like that. No, <laughs> it focuses before the picture takes. So that's good, right? You can still take a solid picture. And that's my whole point. You just gotta give it a second to autofocus. So calm down all you naysayers. And I get it, it's your money. You spend it how you want. If you don't want to wait a second or two to autofocus because it's unacceptable because these older models don't have that problem. I get it. I totally get it. Return your phone, but you're going to regret it. You're going to wish that you waited for this update to come out. If it does come out, if it doesn't come out, well, then I'm going to wish I returned my phone because I do find for the price point, this unacceptable. I know it doesn't seem like a big deal, but for many people out there, it is enough to make them return the phone. There are other aspects about this that people don't like. I don't really understand. I have fallen in love with my S20 Ultra. I even say it correctly, like 99% of the time, that's how much I love it. And that's what I want you to know. So for the love of tech is making videos every single week and I want you to be part of it. So come hit that notification bell, make sure you're subscribed to the channel. If, well, I think you hit the subscribe and then the notification bell. That's what you do. Make sure you're subscribed, then you hit the notification bell, then you get notified, hopefully, when videos come out, and then you can be part of the community. Don't forget to leave a comment, ask a question, tell me I suck, because everybody tells me I suck in almost every single video. I'm called a liar, a fraud, a fake. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm talking about. This guy's stupid. He talks too slow. Oh, <laughs> stuff so much love in my comment section give me a little bit more love i can take it till next time for the love of tech namaste